If you're like me and couldn't get used to the Windows 8 uh, start screen, um, I was just, I like the look of it, um, but it just became way too hard to find my applications um, when you go to all apps. Um, it's just, there's just so many there and it's um, quite a lot of work to try to organize it into different uh, live tile columns and, and stuff like that. So I went looking to see what the best solution to bring back the start menu would be. And what I found was uh, star doc start 8. So all you have to do is just go to star doc dot com slash products slash start eight and that'll take you to their start eight page just click get it now now there is a small price um, for this software um, outside of the free trial um, but after I downloaded the free trial and used it um, it was well worth the five dollars there are some other programs out there that are free um, but they just don't do as good as a job as this does. So we can click try it for free. It'll ask you for an email address. Once you get your email, you'll be able to download it from here. and just run through the installer. Then it'll give you the option of what style you wish to use. Um, I preferred the Windows 7 style, leaving it with the default theme, and I like the flag start button. So that's all you need and then you'll notice your start button is back. Um, looks very similar to the Windows 7 except they did clean up the styles um, with the square edges um, so that it blends um, seamlessly into the Windows 8 desktop. And the great thing about it is you still have access to the Windows 8 menu but you're not stuck constantly going back and forth to it. Now one thing that is nice about this, and, and it's just a very well, um, well made software, is when you're in the Windows 8 menu and you're uh, going around in different browsers, the start button or start area of the screen takes you to the new Windows 8 start screen. So if you're in this interface, you, you can stay in this interface and you can take advantage of all the different um, programs inside of it. So if we went to um, weather, we can pin it and we can still stay you know, inside this interface, start bringing us back here. But once we jump over to the desktop, we can stay completely in the desktop with the classic start menu. I hope this gives you a solution to the Windows 8 start menu. Um, like I said, it does cost you know five dollars, but for me it was well worth it. Um, very clean, um, a very good integration. Um, I actually hope to see uh, Microsoft do something similar to this. Uh, for desktop computers. Um, you, you can see it still gives you all the Windows 8 integration and all the things that you know was great about it. Um, having that start menu back just makes life so much easier. Um, and it still lets you launch Windows 8 apps directly from the start menu. So it's a very very good integration um, and I hope you check it out. Thanks for watching.